The most common type of a blank roll of film is where there are no photos, but you can still see the markings along the edge. The first reason this may have happened is that you did not load the film correctly and the film was not being advanced as you took photos. To prevent this, make sure the film leader is held firmly in place when you first load the film and that the rewind knob is turning every time you advance the film. The second reason for a blank roll of this type is that your camera's shutter may be malfunctioning, either not opening up at all or staying open for far too long or short of a time. You can try firing both long and short exposures with no film in the camera to see if your shutter is behaving properly. The third reason is that you left the lens cap on while shooting photos. This really only happens with rangefinder style cameras where the viewfinder and the lens that takes the photo are separate. If you're shooting with a rangefinder style camera, then get in the routine of always taking your lens cap off first when going out to shoot. The fourth reason why you may have gotten a blank roll like this is you accidentally loaded a blank roll into your development tank by accident. To avoid this, you can mark each roll with a marker immediately after you finish shooting it. If you find that your roll of film has come out completely blank with no markings on it whatsoever, then it's likely that you mixed up the chemicals during the development process. You probably put in the fixer before the developer, which results in the roll of film being wiped completely clean. In order to avoid this, make sure to never rush when developing your own film, as well as only developing when you're not fatigued and can pay close attention to everything you're doing. If your roll of film seems largely blank, but you can see the markings on the edge, as well as some faint details, you've probably severely underexposed your roll of film. This can be caused by a broken light meter in your camera, reading the scene incorrectly. It could also be that your flash didn't go off or was being used at a shutter speed that's too fast. You could also be using a film with an ISO that's far too low for the lighting situation you're trying to shoot. If your film comes out completely black, this means that it's been exposed to way too much light. This is usually caused by the mishandling of film, allowing it to be exposed to large amounts of light, often during the transfer from the film canister to the developing tank when there's any light present. Remember that when you take it out of the canister, you need to be in complete and total darkness. Lastly, if you see partial areas of your film roll as blank like this, it's usually because the film stuck to itself during the development process and those areas of the film never came into contact with any developer. You can avoid this by being careful and deliberate when loading the film onto the development tank reel. If you like this video, please go ahead and hit that like button and subscribe to Prime Studios for more photography videos. Thanks.